In the wet season, the Kalahari sands are loosened by the rain, making them easier to excavate. Damara mole rats, which spend their lives underground, are now at their most active, hunting for roots and bulbs. But digging takes 1,000 times more energy than traveling on the surface. And even in this greenest of African deserts, the bulbs can be widely spread. Living on its own, a single mole rat would never find enough to eat. So these small rodents have evolved a cooperative lifestyle, with up to 40 family members working together. Like ants or bees, only the queen mole rat breeds, and all her workers are sterile females. But everybody will benefit from the extra mouths who'll eventually join in the hunt for food. Damara mole rats are unusual in that their lips are actually behind their front teeth. It helps them to avoid swallowing sand while digging, but it also stops them drinking, so they must extract all the moisture they need from the bulbs. During the wet season, the bulbs are gathered quickly before they germinate and lose their goodness. The mole rats store them in special larders as insurance against the dry months ahead. Living underground, mole rats are sheltered from the Kalahari's worst extremes of temperature. We think of deserts as hot places, but nightly temperatures can fall well below zero. <laughs> 